Last year, the price per share of StockX increased by K% and the earnings per share of StockX increased by M%, where K is greater than M. By what percent did the ratio of price per share to earnings per share increase in terms of K and M? So in this video, I'm just going to show an algebraic approach. So let's just say that P is the price and E is the earnings. So the original ratio, of course, was just P over E. Then P increases by K percent. Well, what does that mean? To increase by K percent, we have to change K to a, a fraction or a decimal. So K divided by 100. Then add 1 to it to get a multiplier. And then multiply that by P. So P times 1 plus K over 100 is K is P increased by K percent. And similarly, E times 1 plus M over 100 is E increased by M percent. So I'm just going to multiply numerator and denominator times 100 to clear the, the tiny fractions inside. And what I get is P times 100 plus K over E times 100 plus M. And basically, what we want to know is the change in these ratios. We have P over E, basically P over E times 1. And we want to compare 1 to this ratio. What is the percent ch change, the percent increase from that ratio? Well, the way we calculate a percent increase, percent increase is the new minus the old over the old times 100. That's how you calculate a percent increase. Well, the new is 100 plus K over 100 plus M, that ratio, minus the old, which is 1. And I'm going to rewrite 1 so it has a common denominator, 100 plus M over 100 plus M, all over 1. So that doesn't matter. So we get the, and then we have to multiply, whoops, have to multiply all this times 100. So we get 100 plus M, 100 plus K minus 100 plus M, that will just be K minus M, whole thing times 100. And so this is K minus M in parentheses times 100 over 100 plus M. And in fact, what this is, is answer choice D.